Will you wait for me at the table? Okay. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi, Alia. We drew our friends today. Are you my friend too? Yeah, I hope I'm your best friend. And who's that? Give me that. Wow, which one of you is friends with the hawk? This is my uncle Costa, who gave me the tank. How is Sir he? Isn't he bored? Ah, yes, listen. Can you take a fresh look at him? A review or what? Something like that. Okay, I'm on break soon, I'll come and look. Mom, I won the tank battle. Six to five, and Val didn't give up. Oh, really? <laughs> well done. Come on, we'll be right over there. Two macchiatos. You know, I painted this picture in literally two hours. The light was falling so beautifully. It inspired me in a second. Shall I go? Yes, see you later. Well, what do you think? Nice. You know, it's very nice. The European school has been to your advantage. Thank you. Mm-hmm. I plan to come back. I received a very good offer from Spain. Maybe you shouldn't be in such a hurry. Do you miss me? <laughs> <laughs> if you miss me, come and see me. Olena asked about you. She wants to consult you about the design of her house. Mm? Yeah. Olena is good. I would like to meet her. How about tomorrow? I can't. I'm flying to Istanbul. We rented a yacht <sighs> with friends. Christina, that's not right. I promised her that we would visit her soon. Who gave you the right to decide for both of us? Dear, please, uh, do me a favor. I'm begging you. Okay. I'll do it once, mm -hmm. but not again. By the way, Kostya will be there too. I haven't seen Kostya for a long time. I hope he's doing well. I wanted to ask you, do you and Kostya have any misunderstandings? No. We just broke up. Sorry, I have to go. Hi, Michelle. Hi. Hi, great exhibition. Well, what do you think, Alia? You're not against me? What are you talking about? <laughs> this is a review. Am I really good enough? Well, considering the cocktail you made, you're good. But I won't let you hurt Val. Me neither. Ah, that's, I realized, of course, that the women in this family are very determined. Hello. Oh, hi, Uncle Kostya. Hello, handsome man. Well done. Hi, I'm Kostya. Hello. My name is Val. I'm Sir He. A pleasure. You too. What are you doing? You come in without warning? Why did you hug me? Sasha and my sister saw it. What am I going to tell them now? That we're in a relationship? He's a small and lively kid. So? He has feelings. He's not a toy that you can just turn on and off. Wait, I didn't do anything bad. He likes you, and it's not fair. We didn't agree that he would know about our relationship. I don't want him to be involved in this. He was only with me in the restaurant because I didn't have anyone to leave him with. I wasn't going to introduce him to you or Gosha. That was too serious for me. He's the most precious person to me. I'm sorry, I got carried away. But I like Sasha too. Can I be a family friend? Yes, you can. Don't you think it would be easier to find another girl to do this? Maybe, but I don't want to. So I'm looking for a restaurant with kids entertainment. So you, do you want Sasha to come to the restaurant with us? If you don't mind. And you'll be like a family friend? And a little more when Sasha can't see.
Thank you. There's a very interested man sitting in that car. Thank him. Thank you to you. Grandpa, we'll see who's who. What do you want, ladies' man? Hey, Kostya. You won't believe what happened to me. Did someone punch you in the face? Well, of course I believe it. Wait, how did you know? Doesn't matter. What do you want? Listen, tell me. Did Alia come to your restaurant, well, after that day? After what day? Uh, after the day you were an asshole. Do I need to talk to her again? No, 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 it's nothing. Hmm. Maybe I need to end some more of your relationships? Listen, I just wanted to say, you've been a huge help and you're a real friend. You know, the fact that you made me look like an idiot's nothing, we'll work it out. But you will have to apologize to the girl. She's only to blame for not recognizing the real you in time. I know it'll be hard, but try. I think we've worked it all out. You understand me. Bye. I have a lot to do. Hi, Olena. Hi. Hi. <sighs> Your roses are so beautiful. Yes. They're as beautiful as their owner. Mm, what an elaborate compliment. You know how I feel about you. Just because I don't talk about my feelings, it doesn't mean they don't exist. Don't get started. <sighs> Vitaly's been gone 10 years. Ten years, I, I don't understand why we can't get back to this conversation. Ilya, it's better not to destroy our long-standing friendship. Wait, Olena, wait, why spoil it? Why? I just think that our friendship is a great foundation for something more. I think we're too old to start something from scratch. <gasps> Rejected once again. <laughs> By the way, I found out about the girl who slapped Quisha. And I can tell you something about her too. Yeah? Yeah. Then come on, tell me. Olena, wait. Olena. <laughs> Yes, Val? I'm listening. Speak quickly, please, because I'm leaving. Sorry, we left so quickly. Sir Hay was called to work. Tell me about the details. I already told you everything. He just gave me a ride after the police and... And it started. <laughs> was it love at first sight? And you introduced him to Sasha. You usually go slow with these things. <gasps> but he doesn't slow down. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Listen. In general, it's good. And Sasha finally sees a normal man. He needs a model of male behavior. And how long have you known this Koistra, hmm? It's okay, but I didn't even think anything would happen, you know? 
You haven't told me anything. Sister, there's something you're not saying. I just don't understand. If you don't understand, don't ask. Okay, fine, we'll talk later. Dang, even a fool can see you're in a serious relationship. How did you figure it out? Well, because he's not only dating you, but he's also taking care of Sasha. If I understand anything about men, is that they take care of other people's children only when they're in love with the mother. Vala, are you coming? You know everything, Val. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna go, bye. Okay, stop hiding, Gosha. Be a man. What's Custa doing here, huh? Hello, handsome. Can you buckle yourself? Get it. What was that? <sighs> wow. Stand up straight and whoa. Once again, whoa. Smart, handsome, wealthy. You're just a prince. For some reason, I think I've just been insulted. Hmm. You've no interest in princes? You know, there are a few princes and not enough for everyone. <laughs> well, according to your observations, Guasha is quite a prince, too. You're right. Let's consider it the first and last experience with princes. I feel somehow inferior, as if Gosha and I have been put in some kind of untouchable social class. Come on, I'm the one who has to know my place. Okay, so what's going on with your family gatherings? What the hell, Kostya? Why are you seducing her, huh? enough impressions for a week. You're good with children. I think it's easy and fun with Sasha. So, for your parents, we met in Italy at a coffee festival? Yes, last summer we had a whirlwind romance. Then your phone was stolen, I drowned mine, and we lost contact, we lost each other. It's not a very plausible story. Well, the simpler the better. And the day before yesterday, I met you at Prague, our eyes met, and we were destined to meet again. And if they find out about your affair with Gorsha, it was just a fling. 
And as soon as I showed up, you broke up with him. I broke up with him. Well, yeah. It's just better for my parents. Can I help? Yes, thank you. So they meet every evening. <sighs> Did he invite her over? No, but he went into her house and didn't come out till morning. In your opinion, what's their relationship? There's definitely a relationship between them. They're not just friends. What is it, love, a fling? I'm not ready to draw conclusions yet. <sighs> There's strong feelings, there's attraction. Kostya, in my opinion, is the more interested. It's also very evident in the way he treats her child. And the woman? Is she a temptress? She doesn't give that impression. But she's quite nice. Okay, if there's something extraordinary, call me. But it's so much more comfortable. Dad, you're acting like it's a lifetime thing. I've had enough of it. Even a healthy person would feel disabled in that chair. Grandpa, really, you only need to get to the car. You can even dance at home. Don't be a wise ass. Where are you supposed to be? Out there looking for a bride. And I looked all over, and I found her. Okay, I, I see you're okay. You two keep arguing, and I'll go. We'll be together for dinner, of course. What? He looks tired. Huh. He did his job. Oh, Kostya, hi. Hi there. Uh, how's Grand? Thank oh. God, everything's fine. Mm. Excuse me, I'm in a hurry. <sighs> and this person accuses someone of being annoying. Is he asleep? Do you want coffee? I'll never turn down a coffee. Me neither. What kind of coffee would you like? The whole collection. What's this flavor? Depending on what you feel like, there are many different options. <sighs> How about this one? Thank you for letting me stay.
Grandpa's agent is still there. Well, you can stay here with me. While he's here. doing really great, Alia. Gosha's place in your bed hasn't even had time to cool down yet, and you've already put a new guy in it, and he's even cooler than the first. Tanya, why are you so worried about my bed? You don't even have time for your own. I don't understand why you need this promotion at all. Well, you really found a great guy. I don't get it. Don't you have any work to do? You're always talking. I'm sorry, Hannah. How are you, Alia? I'm fine. You're not getting married? Why do you ask? Our girls love to gossip. I understand you have a very respectful gentleman, and so if you're thinking about I... quitting, I wasn't even thinking about it. I don't want it to turn out that I'm counting on you, and then you have completely different plans. You can count on me. <laughs> well, okay. I think you'll be able to prove yourself more as an administrator. Thank you, Hannah. Go back to work. So being a barista is your calling? Yeah. Instead of dolls, I played with coffee beans. Don't you dream of owning your own? It's still a long way off. You don't have to dream. Your business is already waiting for you. Do you think that's good? I, by the way, as the only heir, have no choice. Are you a cynic? Actually, I like what I do. My whole childhood was spent in family restaurants. My father often traveled on business trips and my mom and I went with him. Later, when he passed away, all of his affairs were transferred to me. What happened to him? The three of us were in a car. My mom and I got away with scratches, but my dad... That's so terrible. Yeah, it is. I'm beginning to understand your grandfather. You know, his desire to get you married as soon as possible. Are you serious? It's terrible to lose your only son. And if you have a child, he'll have a successor. He'll be calmer that way, I guess. Can I ask a personal question? Sasha's father, where is he? We met in the economics department. We dreamed of getting married. In my fifth year of studies, a pregnancy test showed a positive result. And he was very happy, he said we should celebrate. He ran to get the champagne. And I never saw him again. Did something happen? What happened was that while I was running around looking for him in hospitals and crying to the police, he changed his number and transferred to another city. So I... It's difficult for me to introduce Sasha to anyone. It must be hard to raise him alone. It's not hard. He's my pride. <sighs> How's your spy? 
Is he in hiding? It's still here. Let's go to bed then. I'll make you a bed on the couch. Hi. How's it going? What do you want? Alia, I... I came to apologize. You already apologized. I... I want to do it right. I'm sorry for treating you like that. You wanted to break up, we broke up. The issue is over. What else? Alia, what's with you and Kostya? And what are you looking at, Ella? Fine, I'm guilty. I'm guilty, I admit, and I'm ready to atone for my guilt at any cost. Why did you rush home from the hospital? To drink and eat whatever you want? Oh, I'm tired of you, Ella. I'll fire you. I'm going to quit this job myself, so I don't watch you destroy yourself. Then don't look. Just don't look. By the way, what's for dinner? You can check the menu. No, that's not for me. Only in the looked and approved. I like to eat everything. But what our future daughter-in-law likes we just don't know. You shouldn't have to organize these things. You have a temper. <laughs> Your grandson is like you. He'll bring you some God forbid trashy girl. Well, we'll see. Alia, you still haven't answered me about Kasia. I replied that it's none of your business. Maybe you need a ride. Where to? Go show you messed up. Now you don't have to drive me anywhere. You came after all. It's okay. Maybe it's for the best. You look Thanks. great. Hi, Gosh. Sorry, we're in a hurry. Let's chat later. What are you two doing? Are you together? Kasia, she's actually mine. Alia's not yours. Your history's over. I'm her boyfriend now. And don't bother her anymore. I won't pretend we're friends. Is this a joke? Yeah, you're kidding me. Alia, I've already apologized. What more do you want? You wanted to break up. You broke up. That's it. Bye. It's the money for you, isn't it? Don't get your hopes up. You won't Shut stay up. together. A couple months, no more. Yes, everything is fine, thank you. Mikhail, we have everything ready. I am incredibly grateful to you. So who is this guy? I don't know yet. I got a call directly after this situation. Yes, very interesting. Uh, I never thought that Kostya would get so carried away, so much that he'd Take someone else's girl, and she's got a kid. Yes. I'm very interested in meeting this femme fatale. <sighs> Take this. This is for my parents. You realize 
that your job is to make them unhappy. Of course, I'm not your match. Something like that. My mom, good manners are very important to her. I'll write that down. I'm going to blow my nose loudly into the tablecloth and snort. Ella is a domestic helper who's been with my grandpa so long, she's practically family. She hates short skirts and exposed navels. You look very pretty today, of course, but- What but? Should I have worn half-ass shorts and a leather bra? Well, not really. Take this cake away. Stop the car, I mean it, open it. Shoot. Where are you going? I'm not going anywhere. Wait, 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 wait. Just wait. What happened? Are you upset about Gosha? Why are you listening to him? He's just jealous that you're with me. I'm not with you. Basically, Gosha is right. You would never be interested in someone like me. You don't need a woman with a sense of self-esteem. You just need your inheritance. We had an agreement. I negotiated on different terms. You promised to help me. I've changed my mind. Goodbye. You know what? You're right. I was a fool to think I could count on you. That you would help. You... You're just not capable of keeping your promise. I'll manage without you. I'll manage without you. I don't understand. They're late and Koish just not picking up the phone. Maybe something happened. Why are you stressed, Orlena? The girl works at a bar. Maybe she just got held up. Well, well, don't worry. Yeah, it is a strange choice. You know, I have no taboos, but she's a waitress with a child. And this is after Christina. Everyone has been waiting for you. <sighs> uh, Alia is on her way. She was held up at work. It's just been amazing. Oh, Lena, don't fuss. Excuse me. <clears throat> Hello. I'll go oh, meet you her. Have a mirror, great. Now I. Alia has arrived. She's an acquaintance of Koistra's. Hey, why so formal? Oh, hello. I'm Alia, your son's girlfriend. Grandpa, hi, this is a gift of wine for you. Dang, I'm so hungry, it's awful. Kitty, pour me some white, please. Ooh, 
Oh, <laughs> red caviar, I love it. <laughs> Great. By the way, this is a very good wine. I bought it in a special store. It's been laying in the cellar for probably a hundred years. <laughs> Mom? Yes? Can I lie down with you? Sure, come here. I'm so glad I have you. And I have you and Val and Grandma. So very rich. Does Uncle Costa have a family? Of course. Are they good? I liked them. Grandpa, to your health. Mm -hmm. Hey, <laughs> I'm out of wine. Ida, don't worry yourself. Ella, could you please bring us another bottle of wine? Uh, you said you were very valued at work, Alia. Soon I'll become manager. Uh, you also went to a coffee festival in Italy, right? Oh, right. <laughs> I met my honey boo there. You're so beautiful. You had herds of suitors, I'm sure. No, no. I don't like those Italians too much. Well, they're stingy. Well, they're... <laughs> Thank you. Not like our Kostya, just imagine. He gave me this diamond right away. Cool, right? <laughs> He's not greedy, it's obvious. <laughs> I'm nowhere near your level, of course. But it's okay. We'll get through it. We're just starting out. Everything's ahead of us, right, Kitty? <sighs> Ayla, you must try the meat. Ella cooks so well, it'll melt in your mouth. Mm. Yes, some people could use a mouthful. Mmm, wow. That meat's phenomenal. It's great meat. I'm just <laughs> already full. <laughs> Alia, I understand you have a son. I understand you do, too. Thanks for reminding me. I have to go put him to bed. Kostya and I are going to see a movie. You know, mm, he has a lot of work, so you and I can go together. It's hard for adults to make friends. It's hard.
Dad, are you serious? You hired people to spy on Kostya? I'm just following orders. Poor guy. He can't even have a private life. And if he'd had been seeing someone else, there wouldn't have been any spying. Can I? Yeah, of course. Yeah, well, let's see who you exchanged me for. Hmm. She's beautiful. Circumstances have changed. I'm very worried that Kostya will make the wrong choice. Hmm. Why not tell him your bag? I'm sure he'll be happy. I hope so. She has a child? Yeah. She does. Yeah. She's a serious opponent. I'll have to do my best.